praise the name of the Lord. Mark 11, 23. For verily I say unto you, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart, but shall believe that those things which he said shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he said. This morning, as you worship with me in the comfort of your home, I'm led by the spirits to prophesy that all the mountains standing against your life and destiny are cleared away now in the mighty name of jesus whatever is serving as a mountain in any area of your life whatever is serving as a mountain in any aspect of your life is commanded right now to clear away in the mighty name of jesus i speak to that mountain facing your finances to disappear quickly in the mighty name of jesus let a mountain facing your business your 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 family your marital affairs your your conception and any other area of your life disappear quickly in the mighty name of jesus i say to the mountain standing before you to go away in the mighty name of jesus i say to that mountain standing before your business standing before your career standing before your academy standing before any realm of your life to move away in the mighty name of jesus for verily i say unto you that whosoever shall say unto this mountain be thou removed and be thou cast into the sea and shall not doubt in his heart but shall believe that those things which he said shall come to pass he shall have whatsoever he said he shall have whatsoever he said in his sickness seven as a mountain in your life is commanded to move away in the mighty name of jesus i scatter any sickness serving as a mountain in your life in the mighty name of jesus i scatter every barrenness serving as a mountain in your life in the mighty name of jesus that barrenness serving as a mountain in your marriage is commanded to be scattered in the mighty name of jesus i speak disappearance to that mountain of barrenness fighting your marriage in the name of jesus i speak disappearance to that mountain of infertility fighting your womb in the mighty name of jesus all the mountains in your life are under arrest today in the mighty name of jesus whatever is seven as an obstacle to the progress of your life is commanded to clear away in the name of jesus any mountain standing before you to sabotage your progress is commanded to clear away right now in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus in any faculty of your life if they be any mountain that is standing against you i speak disappearance to that mountain right now in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus for verily i say unto you that whosoever shall say unto this mountain be thou removed and be thou cast into the sea and shall not doubt in his heart but shall believe that those things which he said shall come to pass he shall have whatsoever he said this verse is talking about the god kind of faith the god kind of faith or the god type of faith 
Mark 11, 23 is teaching us about the God kind of faith or the God type of faith. What is the God type of faith? The God type or the God kind of faith believes something in his heart and speak it out through his mouth. And the Bible says that when you speak it, you have it. When you speak it, you get it. You believe in your heart and then you speak it through your mouth and you get the results you desire. That is the God kind of faith. You believe something in your heart, then you speak it out through your mouth and you get the results that you desire. For verily I say unto you, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, that is the problems in your life. If you can address the issues in your life with faith filled words, those issues will just leave your life alone and you are going to enjoy a colorful Christian journey on planet earth. For verily I say unto you that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, whosoever shall say to this sickness, whosoever shall say to this barrenness, whosoever shall say to this infertility, whosoever shall say to this death, whosoever shall say to this mountain, be thou removed and be thou cast into the sea and shall not doubt in his heart. But shall believe that whatsoever he says shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he said. Speak to the problems in your life and they will leave. Speak against the mountains standing against your life and you have no other choice but to disappear out of your life. For verily I say unto you, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart, but shall believe that those things which he saith shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he saith. You shall have whatsoever you say. You shall have whatsoever you say. It means that there's power in your words. There's power in your words. You shall have whatsoever you say. If you can say it, you get it. If you can say it, you own it. If you can say it, you will seize it. You shall have whatsoever he said. For verily, I say unto you that whosoever, this is talking about you, whosoever, whosoever, whosoever shall say, whosoever shall say, whosoever shall say to this mountain, be thou removed and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart, but shall believe that those things which he says shall come to pass, he shall have whatsoever he said today as you pray have the faith that whatsoever you shall say shall come to pass as you pray with me have this faith in your spirit that whatsoever you say today shall come to pass thank you lord